With us now are Mark and Vanessa, and we're going to be talking about an amazing baby expo that you're not going to want to miss. If you're a grandparent, a parent-to-be, you have to go. Check them out. Hello, hello, welcome. Hi, thank you. June 7th, tell us about your event. Okay, so June 7th, the Expecting Parents and Baby Expo being held at Leonard's of Great Neck. Okay, and how did your uh, medical group get involved? Mark reached out to us as far as whether we would like to participate in the event, uh, if we would like to speak about a topic of interest, or if we wanted to speak on a panel. So we have uh, nurses, nurse educators, and we, we were very excited to be a part of it. And I've known Mark for years, and he does these wonderful expos. I mean, you're really an expert at this. And why do you think that expectant parents need to be educated and entertained, and why did you decide this? Why is it important for you? First of all, my business uh, looks to provide resources for communities of people. Okay. And the expecting parents and new parents community um, is is a very, you know, worthwhile and fun community to be a part of. And there are so many resources out there, so many new things and information, and um, it's just a pleasure to be able to make that available to people. I think when uh, people get married, you know, there's so many wedding planners and all that other kind of stuff. And then sometimes when you decide to have a baby, you're kind of on your own, besides a couple of books that we, well-known books that we know. Mm -hmm. So I think this idea for an expo is just fantastic. You know, what are you hoping uh, to talk about there, Vanessa? What are some of the things that are going to be important topics well, for you? Well, I, I wear a number of different hats. I'm a nurse educator at NASA University Medical Center. I am a volunteer for, um, to help with women with perinatal mood disorders for the Postpartum Resource Center of New York. I also teach Lamaze classes, parenting classes, so I really do the whole gamut. And, um, and so what I don't do is actually in the labor room with, uh, with women, you know, helping them labor. But up until that point, I can prepare you. So I'm hoping to talk a little bit about um, perhaps a child with classes and also engage the mom and let them know that, um, you know, what to expect after the baby comes. And that's sort of something that's not always uh, plan for, like a mood disorder, like a postpartum depression. So I'm hoping to prepare moms in that aspect. So there's great ideas for like gifts, but also the mental, the holistic approach, I guess, exactly, to becoming exactly. a parent for you is well, what you're putting it, together. Yeah, I mean, there's so much to know. There's um, cord blood banking, which I don't know how many years ago, but didn't exist when we were having our kids, that's for sure. And, um, you know, the whole uh, breast versus bottle feeding um, to really hear it explained, um, the movement now for uh, uh, breastfeeding women to have places, public places to to feed. There's just so ma so many new resources out there, and um, people need to know about them. And you pulled them all together, and I know you have a doula coming. You have so many different things. Mm -hmm. Now, do people need to sign up for a seminar, or how does it work exactly? You get a ticket, and how does it work? The seminars are going to be open to everybody who wants to attend them. Okay. And, and what are the running hours of the expo? From when to From when? From 9 a.m. till 2 p.m. Okay. on Sunday, June okay. 7th. So you could come. You could bring your family. You could stay from 9 to 2. You know, bring your this... children. There's going to be demonstrations, mommy and me activities, things like that. It's, it's a right. fun we'll time. We'll have tables set up so you can stop for a minute, stop for you know, a couple of hours, and go in there, get what you need, and, and just walk away feeling prepared and, and certainly empowered. Mm -hmm. and, and hopefully a pair of those, you know, cute baby booties. Because I know when I left the hospital with my babies, they had to have little booties and a little hat, right? <laughs> and there's lots of giveaways, too. Oh, wonderful. A lot right. of the exhi exhibitors are giving away samples of their products. And um, that's always a, a, a big draw for attendees. Absolutely. They live with bags full of stuff. Okay, and how can somebody get a ticket to your event? Where would they go? They can go on the website. It's okay. expectingparentsbabyexpo.com. That sounds like fun. And, and, and you know what? Stay tuned for more because there's always something happening and you guys are bringing all the expected parents all the information that they need. So yeah. thanks, guys. I'll be there. I'll definitely be there. Even though I'm not expecting, I'm not expecting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can play Donna. an expected mother on TV, but not now. <laughs> all right. Stay tuned for more. We've been visiting with Mark and Vanessa about their wonderful baby expo. It's going to be happening June 7th at Leonard's of Great Neck. See you there.